All right, guys, so this is the fears to fathom. These games are based on real stories, FYI. Really? Hey, I noticed you were requesting story submissions while I was watching a YouTuber play Fears to Fathom Carson House. What I'm about to recount happened when I was 24 or so at the time. It feels kind of weird telling anyone about this because of the bizarre and absurd nature of the whole thing. But I feel like doing so might help my me process my memories of it. I'm having a stroke, I think. I knew that sharing this story anywhere else would be a dumb idea because people would say I was lying. As I'm writing this, this was the scariest experience of my life. I'm Jack Nelson. Had a small job as a park ranger in the state park. I was a fire lookout stationed to one of the largest forests in the Pacific Northwest. Miles and miles of dense forest managed by the Forestry Service. I had a salary that allowed me to make ends meet, but I couldn't afford to treat myself to restaurants, nice clothes, etc. My biggest accomplishment so far is being able to buy an RV for myself with a lot of financial help from my dad. Ooh. Guys, this horror game is terrifying. He's broke. The scariest part of the story is that this guy is broke. Ooh. The pores. Poor people. Hey you. Yeah, you. Are you trying to make money by playing sh mobile games? Well, go to CashKick.com. Cash kick, cash kick, cash kick. I made $331 just by playing this sh ass dice game. Look at all the games you can choose from. Holy sh is that the Pawn Stars guy? So many games, so much opportunity to make money. So you might be asking, how do you make the money? All you have to do is sign up at CashKick.com using the link in the description or scanning this QR code. Scan that mother QR code. But before we make that sweet dough, you gotta verify your account. Check your mother email and verify that account. Download the game via CashKick.com and it'll take you to the App Store where you download that mother game. Look at how easy it is. I don't even know what the is going on in this game, but I'm making some money. That's CashKick.com. Click the link in the description or scan the QR code now. Disclaimer, all these games suck. But at least you can make some money. The one time I was transferred from one outpost to another because of some official circumstances. Oh, this one time. It was a minor inconvenience to me, though, since I lived out of my RV and like traveling. I said a few goodbyes, was off to my new location. It was about a two hour drive. Okay, so that's what this is. This is the two hour drive. I'm going on a two-hour drive. Shit. I got a text from Kayla Nelson. Texting and driving. All right, let me check my phone. Oh, no worries at all. Just had to check my text real quick. Driving around. Hands on the wheel. Wind in your hair. One hand on the wheel. Two fingers in my ass. Let's ride. Oh. Excuse me, sir. So we gotta go to this diner. Oh, I guess this would be the diner. All right, hey everybody, I'm here. Welcome to Twin Towers Diner. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Hello, sir. How's the food? He just stared at me. All right, you dick. Good evening, I'm Barbara, are you ready to order? Yes, Barbara. Can I please have a meatball sub with chicken nuggets and a strawberry slush? The Aki way, please. I always had this habit of peeing before eating. Okay. Does that mean I have to go piss? That means I have to go piss. All right. <laughs> Dude, I got f***ing laser piss. Waiter. Yeah, it was great. Check, please. I don't understand these games. This music is so f loud. Oh yeah, Kayla's text. So did you end up going? How was it? I'm here, still eating. Told you, hee hee. Sounds like she's getting a little flirtatious with me. I'm on my way home. Send you in a bit. Ooh. So does Kayla, is Kayla like my fling? I feel like Kayla wants me bad. Oh, Kayla's my sister? Ew. Okay, never mind. Oh, am I here? Yeah. We made it. What exactly am I supposed to do? What happened to hello? Jesus Christ, man. Uh, holy moly, you scared me. I thought you were one of them. What? One of who? Hey, Lord, have mercy. 
Anyways, can I see your permit? You're Billy, right? I'm the new transferred fire lookout? I didn't know we were hiring this season. Hang on, let me check on that. Thanks, man. Uh, yeah, just go back to normal after just being a f psychopath. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay, pal, you're good to go. You're staffed at Fire Tower 11. Oh, I guess I should do an accent for this guy. Okay, pal. You're... <laughs> you're with an extra R. Uh, you're good to go. You're staffed at Fire Tower 11. I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that Jesus Christ. I was under the impression that the tower would be left on staff for the season, but here are your keys. Thank you. This is like, uh, you guys remember, uh, on Webkins? Be like, gems, trade in your gems here, or whatever. Since you're arriving this late, you might also need this flashlight for the long hike to your lookout. Thank you, Billy. You be careful now. Take this. I'm gonna go watch Fox News. If you need be, you can reach out to Tower 12 during your staff and night up guy. He'll be a card to contact that the mercy. Word. What the shit? I want you, son. I want you so bad. That's wildly inappropriate, sir. Hey, just got a piece of advice. Don't travel any further than half a mile or so north of your tower. Why? Dangerous woods that way, pal. Bobcats and bears. Nasty business. You got it. Word. New guy. Haven't gotten your name yet. What is it again? I saw your light turn on. I'm Jack. Jacking off. <laughs> no, excuse me. Jacking off is my father's name. I'm, uh, Jack Smith. I saw your light turn on. I gotta say, it's refreshing to see Tower 11 live again. You were watching? I've had to cover your area until you arrived. I'm Connor. Fire Tower 12. Nice. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? <laughs> I'm really tired. Can I just say that? I'm gonna say looking for a change. Okay, he's just being quiet. I don't want to be the beta male in the situation and double text this guy. Or double message this guy. You don't want to sit through the storm shitting. All right, well, guess I'm gonna start a fire. I don't see the smoke. Did you light it up yet? No. You did. You you were gone for 30 seconds, man. What do you know? Where's my wood at? I swear to God, I saw wood earlier. No firewood. There must be plenty in the shack. Of the staffer who was in the lookout before you. She was one gritty woman. <laughs> uh, one what woman, dude? Yeah, thank you for making that clear, Connor. We've already yes, established we this. Cabin, but if not, you can always grab your supplies. Yes, we've already we have established all of this, Connor. That should be enough. Surely that won't burn my entire place to the ground. Yup. Yeah. Right uh, next to all the gasoline that I put on the ground. Surely that won't be a problem at all. I see the smoke. Thanks, Connor. Um, stop talking to me. Yeah, you said that already. Did you report for the night yet? No. You better get to it then. Here at Iron Bark, you are required to report every night before signing off. You don't want to disappoint Mitch on your first night. Yeah, okay, man. What is your problem? Jesus Christ. Okay, temperature 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Wind speed 700. Number of hikers assisted zero. Reported by me. Something didn't look right. God damn it. You copy, new guy? Woo! Tower 11. Copy. Gonna sign off for the day. Gonna sign off for the day? Alright, well thanks for letting me know, Tower Connor. 12, signing off. You have a good night, new guy. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Good night. Over and out. Cornball. I guess Connor's getting lonely here. He keeps hitting me up. It's like, what do you want to sleep with me, dude? What's happening? Where's nothing at this cop? Alright, 326 AM. Whoa. Connor, is this you hitting me up late night for some kind of booty call situation? Connor? I had to pee. Okay. Just like me for real. Can I go to sleep? Oh, <laughs> will I just piss myself in my sleep? That's awesome. Whoa, dude. You cannot let the words come that slow. You have eyes on the smoke north of your position. <sighs> Connor. I can do everything. Eyes on the smoke north of my position. Oh yeah. That smoke alright, Connor. I need you to confirm. 
Yeah, I, I got it, Connor. Jesus Christ, dude. You were getting on my last nerve. Did you spot that white smoke up north? Yeah. Yes! I did! Give me five seconds! Jesus! It to be in the lazy trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. Yeah, we established that People already. Like that don't bother to clean up after themselves. Am I checking it out? <laughs> is it safe? Can I say is it safe? Okay, I guess so. Carry your bear spray. And you carry your bear spray? Is that real? I love gin. Oh my god, she gives the best head. I'm gonna disregard these people hanging by a noose. All right, we gotta find Jin. All right, new mission, find Jin. Get some head. All right, you bastards. No camping in on my watch. And if anyone tries me, I got some bear spray for your ass, bruh. All right, well, my work here is done. As I hiked back to my tower through the dark, I couldn't shake my ass that something was terribly wrong. I couldn't, excuse me, I couldn't shake the sense that something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened. Shut the f*** up and skip the dialogue. Uh, exit stream. Connor, do you copy? Loud and clear, new guy. I was just cooking myself some hot... Well, first, what's your status? Are you kidding me? You kidding Son me? Of a bitch. What? They never learn, do they? I'm sick of these bastards. It's unbelievable. This is the third time this month alone. Anything else you notice in those woods? A scream. Must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> it was a manly a scream. <laughs> been flocking to that area lately because of the disappearance of those three kids. Kids went. Holy shit! Hold on. Kids went missing in that area. They were hiking with their families. They went off the trail and just vanished. What? It, I, I need to mention the head that Jen is giving. Connor, you won't believe it. There's a woman over there. She's giving, uh, you know, apparently incredible head. What happened to the kids? Their parents said some whistle led them off the trail. It's unbelievable. And we heard whistles. People started spreading rumors that the area might be haunted by some entities. <laughs> Titties. We can't tolerate these goons anymore. Goons? Gooning? Hold on. If they find them, Goon I'll mention. make sure they never set foot in this forest again. Will do. Over and out. God damn, this dude is running this park like it's the Navy. I get done eating dinner. Oh shit, I was woken by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. Whoa. Oh my god, it's Jin just topping me off in bed. I'm like, no, please, Jesus Christ. No. Oh. Where's my flashlight? Where is it? Should I go out there? What? Is that the end of the game? So don't open the door, I guess. What the f was I supposed to do there? So what the f do I do? Do I have like a gun or something? Oh shit. <gasps> Dude, I thought that was in the game for a second. Grab the bear spray and open the door. Will that work? Oh, don't see him. Oh, he put like a little, uh, look at that. He put like a little, um, seance thing it's like a goat head or something okay i'm gonna get my bear spray and i'm gonna open the door i didn't know what to make of it at the moment the only logical thing was to contact connor all right connor this is the only time i ever want to talk to you jesus christ <laughs> you have any idea what time it is connor shut the f up for two seconds for what did your goddamn life I meant to tell him there's a dude outside my door i clicked through that too fast i was nervous these kids can be pretty creative with these pranks well, I know that's not true because I just died. Connor, I've seen death. Okay, I know what happens. Next day I woke up not being so sure if last night was real or just a dream. Next day I woke up not being so sure if last night was real or just a dream. That's what the mask is. Connor tried to reason it as a harmless prank by some kids, but there's something about that night that just felt darker. There's something strange happening in those woods. And... Yes. <laughs> Delp to help. Thank you for the three months. There? Oh, hey, Connor. I need help. Oh, you need help now, Connor. Wow. Where were you when I needed help, dude? All of a sudden, it's such a big deal when you need help, Connor. 
Oh, interesting. Interesting. Well, Connor. Oh, this is a different guy? Oh, uh, whoops. Please, someone answer. Oh, my bad. Uh, I'm lost, and I'm I'm really starting to freak out. What's I, going on? I don't even know where to start. I, I went out to explore the area and lost track of time. Okay. And, and now it's dark, and I can't remember the trail back to my truck. I think I'm lost. Can you describe your clothing? What are you wearing right now? I'm wearing a red jacket, camo mm. pants, and a green backpack. Mm. I'm in the middle of the woods, on this trail surrounded by trees. Everything looks different at night. I, I remember passing a small stream earlier. Hmm. Are we talking piss right now? Can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left get back to the trailhead. Let me take a look at the map. Uh, I don't know what to tell this guy, dude. Directions are not my shit. I'll just tell him to take the left trail. We'll see what happens. All right. I'm at a trail intersection. Left trail. I knew it. I thought it looked familiar. Yep, you're welcome. I'm right here. I hear you. I hear your whistles. What? I see you behind the trees to my right. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, dude. You're freaking me out. Oh, shit. Oh! Suck my dick. Suck my dick. All right. I'm gonna open it. Could be Connor. Hold on. Let me grab my bear spray just in case. Oh, it's just you. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Holy moly. Holy moly. <laughs> Who wrote this? I've been knocking for hours. I was asked to check on you. What were you up to, pal? Anyways, got the tower supplies here. Just the usual essentials. Here you go. I just feel like I'm gonna pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. I'm like, thanks, dude. I hate with the silence. It makes you click through the silences. What were you doing here, there, last night? Up north. Why were you there? I wouldn't screw around out there, pal. You be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal, and there's stuff out there that would love to get a piece of you, including me. Mm. Mm. <laughs> They just start making out. I've been hearing you've been a bit on the edge. Mentions the skull. Oh, Lord have mercy. Did you take a photo of it? You know it's best we don't dwell on these things, pal. Besides, can't do anything without the evidence. Anyways, it's getting late. Uh, thanks for that traumatizing story. Uh, <laughs> better get going now. Like, why couldn't I just grab, like, five? Fuck <laughs> you, dude. What the is your problem? I'm gonna throw this wood at you. <sighs> I understand loneliness can make the mind play tricks on you sometimes. Who are you? No need to be alarmed. I'm a worker. I was just doing routine maintenance on the radio tower over there. Thought I'd say hi to the new guy everyone's been talking about. Every Sunday, just trying to keep the communication lines open. We must ensure that the right message reads, reach the right places. Wouldn't you agree? Some fires are meant to burn. And no amount of prevention can stop them. What the f I should have got my bear spray. Nature has its own plan. Some things can't be controlled no matter how hard we try. And sometimes disasters are just another form of cleansing. A way for land to purify itself. This is getting awfully, you know, creepy. Have a good night, Jack. Hope you sleep well. But remember, curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. Fucking weirdo, I'm gonna beat your ass. You f weirdo, you're just going off into the wilderness. Why is he cheeked up? That's not the questions we should be asking right now. Oh, no, it's not. I just, okay. You there? Yeah, I'm f here, Connor. God. You copy now. Where have you been? Ran into who? Ran into Silas. You know Silas. <sighs> is this about yesterday? You trying to yank my chain now? Oh, shit. Okay, so Silas is not a real guy, which, duh. We knew that. We knew that. That radio tower's been out of service for ages now. You mean to tell me the f creepy ass creepy dude that we saw earlier was lying? The creepy guy that was sending cryptic messages? You mean to tell me that he was lying? Wow. I'm very it surprised. It down years ago after a lightning strike fried its systems, and its repair cost was deemed too costly. Its repair date was postponed until the next big funding, which is no time.
time, Spook. If what you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons playing pranks on Goon you. mentioned. Shout out the goons. Either way, disguising as a staff member is strictly forbidden according to park guidelines. Next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. Dude, why, like, I don't see why you're not concerned even a little bit. The strangeness I'd seen so far in those woods was not enough to cause alarm yet. I disagree. However, that would soon change. Two nights later, holy shit, power is out. All right, well, it's time to go to bed. Don't you dare make me go to the f***ing generator, dude. It's not letting me sleep. I guess I need to go to the generator. Let me grab my bear spray. Actually, maybe I could just close the windows and be fine. It's not letting me close these. Hell yeah. Okay, not letting me sleep. I guess I gotta go downstairs. Generator ran out of gas. Of course it did. That's awesome. All right, everyone gear up. There's gonna be a jump scare. I'm I am so certain there's gonna be a jump scare. Uh, I really had to pee before going back up. You f Peeing everywhere. Peeing everywhere. Peeing quickly. Peeing quickly. Peeing fast. Oh yeah, I do need... Okay. Alright. Wood. 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 Ah! Ah! Me taking out the trash late at night. Ah! 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 Oh yeah, wet wood. <laughs> I guess. Time was flying by. Can't really set fire to wet wood. Time was flying by. Connor's generator was under maintenance. Which meant I had to cover his area for the past two days. When there were no fires going, the only thing I do is check in on Connor twice a day. It might have been the only time I ever talked, unless I was talking to myself. We got another one. Oh my God, Connor, you! F I know it's late, but you're gonna want to see this one, Jack. Jack, Jack, I need you to wake up. You yeah, I'm f here, Connor. God. <sighs> Yes, you f***er. You, you only said it four times. Oh, I don't have the energy to do this right now. You have to go check in the fire. I always have to check in the fires. Shut up, Connor. Fantastic. Let me see. You don't have the energy, Connor. I don't have the energy for your bullshit. Yeah. Uh, you just f***ing said that, dude. They don't run away this time. Take their photos and IDs. And if things get worse, don't hesitate to call HQ for help. We already established okay, that morning. I was going to do this. All right. Well, good night, Connor. All right. I'll just do everything my f***ing self. Oh, that's no normal campfire. You know, that's what they call the devil's campfire. <gasps> oh! Uh-oh. 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 Dude, is that Bigfoot? Is he coming up here? Oh, yes, he he's totally coming up. He's totally coming up. Oh, shit! I think we're safe. I need to pee so bad. I will be right back. Bear spray. I need my bear spray. I had to make a run? Not without my bear spray. Ah! Huh? Oh! 
Oh! Oh! Oh! He's the slowest runner I've ever seen in my life. Shit! No! Okay, shift is not sprint at all. I've been holding shift. What? Bullshit, dude. Oh, I'm supposed to run to the bat to the porta potty? Oh. Oh wait, do I have to go through all this shit again? Yeah, Connor, I got it. You can't do the thing. Got it. Got it, Connor. Hut. Oh shit, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad, bruh. All right, you guys can't say, hear me out. He's got big feet, okay? I had to make a run. Uh... Got it, 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 got it. thought on titties I'll tell you as soon as I beat this game okay as adrenaline kicked in I hit the gas and drove the nearest ranger cabin out of breath I radioed into alert HQ look Jack we all get a little stir crazy out there, Mitch answered. Next morning, authorities allegedly ran a small investigation of the area, but of course they met with no they they met with no signs of misconduct. They were met with no signs of misconduct. No one ever believed my story, dismissing it as a product of isolation. Just stick to looking out for fires. Thanks, Mitch, you fucker. However, that was the last time I ever set foot in those woods. What about the picture I took, dude? The unease still sits heavy in my stomach. Even though many years have passed, the experience still feels vivid in my memory. My family thought I was making the whole thing up, which is really out of my character, but I know what I saw. Real or not? After dark, these woods can become a haven for illegal activities, so if any of you plan on camping soon, please be safe. And then we drove off through the night. the game would you look at that i don't know why he didn't do anything with that picture that he took what about jen and her head that's a great question i feel like that was kind of a blue balls situation they blue balls us <sighs> we did it